Hello YouTube friends. Today is, I can't say an impromptu video, because I have had the idea on my mind for a while. In fact I did a video like this for last year as well. My yearly anniversary with Hyunsuk is something that I think about months in advance cause it's a day very important to me. And I know anyone who listens to me talk, honestly, will know that he's a very important person to me. But as far as this year's video goes, everything I've made thus far has felt a bit stiff. But not making a video didn't really feel right. So I'm just going to simply say what's on my mind. It might not be as of a detailed edited video as last year's might have been. But the importance of the video is what's inside it. Not how it's edited. Because to be honest, most people don't really watch these types of videos anyway. I don't expect them to. It's mostly just me rambling. However a part of me does feel the need to make this a yearly video. After all who knows how things may be different in another year's time. The one thing that I do know with absolute certainty though. Is that I'll still be loving Hyunsuk with my whole heart and the same intensity. Because that's something that has never lessened over time. And it just simply continues to grow the more that I've seen him. I know I must have explained it a lot in the video that I did make last year. But he's helped me through a lot in my life. I couldn't have made it without his presence and I'll forever be eternally grateful and indebted to every single thing he's done for me. He's truly a special person. To help someone get out of their rough patch just by being themselves? Yeah. I think that's something commendable though in a sense. I think that's something that only Hyunsuk could do for me. Anyway nothing against the other members. Or other idols in general. But no one has touched my heart in the same sense that Hyunsuk has. And no one else ever will that much is certain. But I'm really thankful to have been able to get to know him over time through the first glance on it. Of course. I knew this boy was beyond special and had so much talent. The first few episodes that I saw. He was already performing one of his own songs. And with so much charisma that my eyes and attention remained lingering on Hyunsuk long after his performance. And throughout the show and the little clips that went along with it. Igta to see the softness in his personality. And all of these things combined together is what inevitably made me become so enamored with all of his charms. Hyunsuk is one of the most special people in this world to me. I feel like he has it all talent. Charm. Kindness. Uniqueness. Anything that you can name. I'm sure that Hyunsuk has it it's a quirk that not many people have. So it's one of those reasons I've felt really lucky to be a fan of his I knew that he'd be a forever part of my life. It was just a gut instinct from the beginning. But really. Look at me now. I'm here making a video about my anniversary of finding him. Three years later. Really. It was the best thing that could have ever happened to me. I could sit here and talk about to great depth all of the dark things that Hyunsuk helped me through. And honestly I still will. But to start the video at least. I wanted to do my best to highlight some positive aspects. And I'm also trying my best to not repeat what I said in last year's video. But you know what? I think it's okay even if I was to do so. This time. On milestones I always find myself reminiscing about old thoughts. Even if I've mentioned them before but I have so many warm memories that have been welcomed into my heart. And they're only there because Hyunsuk put them there. All of the warm memories of waiting every week for new YGTB episodes. The little contents alongside it. Or the dry period in 2019. Even if there was no new content. I was just happily content rewatching older things. And although this year isn't the same case. I found myself rewatching a lot of older stuff since there's been not as much new content. No new treasure map. But again. These things are fine. Because I totally understand that Hyunsuk is a busy guy. And how devoted he is to always working hard is something that'll always inspire me. You know. Perhaps it's a good time to talk about it. But you know my absence on YouTube. I was actually studying to graduate. To be entirely honest. Wrestling is most important to me however an education is also. So I just wanted to work hard like Hyunsuk has always shown me how to do. Sadly. That was a big part of this year. And I feel like that's a huge part of why I was unable to edit. Guilt surely did eat me up a lot. One of my main motivations to edit is of course to work hard for Hyunsuk and Treasure. I want to maybe help new people into the fandom and welcome warmth into everyone that stops by. I know that I always want to spread happiness to people like Hyunsuk always does. 
I think Mr. Choi has been nothing but a positive influence into my little life and I couldn't be more thankful. Of course do I deserve any of that? Not really, no. But I'm so happy to everything he's been able to do for me. Spreading happiness into my heart. Giving me motivation when I needed it. I never would have been able to graduate without Hyun Suk's inspiration. There's nights I kept myself up studying. Studying over the weekend even. I pushed myself more than I normally would on most occasions because the thought of Hyun Suk doing the same just made me want to do my best. And I tried to stay positive the best I was able to. Because I always see Hyun Suk being so bright and full of energy. Of course. I know he has days that are hard. As much as I don't like to think about them for real. He's my sunshine. The slightest thought of him being upset hurts my own heart. Though I know he's strong and will get through it. I think that's why sometimes when I see him tweet it means more to me. When you read his tweets. You never know if he's having a harder day. Perhaps he's more tired on that day, lacking motivation or is just sad, but he always tries his best to make others smile, and I know that's one aspect of his personality that's given me strength. I know I probably can't make people smile like Hyun Suk does, but I work hard to do the same thing, in my videos, streams, any of that. I think that's why I'm so excited to come back to my YouTube. Because I miss doing things that help treasure in my own way. But also most times I tried my hardest to make you guys smile. Hyun Suk really has been the best role model for me over the past 3 years and just thinking about him makes me feel so warm inside. GKSJHX I think this is why I've been a little scared to make this video. I knew it'd end up with me rambling. I never articulate myself in a neat way. I just go from one topic to the next in a bit of a messy way. But my main goal is just to talk nicely about Hyun Suk. Because I think today is one of the best days to do so. And if you think about it in a deeper way. It's also my three years with treasure. Honestly which I'm also very grateful for. But I mostly consider it Hyun Suk since he's personally done the most for me. But all 12 of the members have made my life extraordinarily special. One day I really do want to make a video going into depth for all 12 of them. But I think I'm getting ahead of myself. I really just want today's video to be about a day that's special to me. I know that things would have ended up detrimentally bad for me if I had not found Hyun Suk. I know that to be true because he's helped me through horrible things while I have directly known him. I know it's something that I do tend to bring up a lot, but Hannah's passing last year was something that really bothered me. Every single last detail in it just makes me feel sick to my stomach and horribly sad, and you know, honestly, every bad situation, I tend to ask myself what Hyun Suk would do, and to be frank, I'm not even sure how Hyun Suk would handle the situation, so in that sense I had no idea what to do, but honestly for me. His presence was enough of a comfort to help me get by, and gradually, get better. Although obviously it's not entirely, I'm still not over the whole situation. I think about her a lot and I always wonder how things would be different if she was still here. And I really wish that she was. But any time I go down that line of thinking, Hyun Suk helps me. I'm very grateful to have him because he's like an angel who can help me through anything. Even now, I know I'm not that great of a person. I feel bad to my friends for always burdening them. To my subscribers because they have to put up with someone like me. I'm a giant mess and I wish I could be a better person for all of you. But I know that as long as I have high unsuck, I should be able to improve or at least. I can only hope so. But if you compare me to the type of person I was 3 years ago, to now, a lot has changed and I think I've changed for the better. But that's truly only changed thanks to Hyun Suk. His positive energy constantly being around just makes me want to do the same. Whether I'm successful or not is a different story. But hey I'm trying my best here. Anyway, I think that this video probably isn't my best executed one. But my main goal here was to just simply talk about my 3 years with Hyun Suk. But I've already done a long letter, along with different versions of this video I've already scrapped. So I just thought I'd do a more simple version, speak my mind, and just simply express I love Hyun Suk more than anyone else in the world. With him being in my life 3 years now, I'm only more certain over this long period of time that he's the most important thing to me and I love him more than anyone else in the whole world. And I can promise that won't ever change he, but again. I don't want to bother anyone so I'll just leave it at that. Whoever watched this, 
I hope you have a good day. Remember that I love you all. You're the best. Bye bye.